reminded the USA who the real favorites were as they beat the co-host today convincingly by seven wickets. Welcome back to the channel. Great to have you back here. Let's get into it. Chop, chop, man. You know, because these matches are just going like crazy. We're trying to keep up. We really are trying, I promise. All right, let's get into it. The USA batted first and made a total of 110 for eight off of their 20 overs. Played in New York again, that wicket again, not gonna say much. Nobody on the USA side passed 30. That's right, nobody. A little disappointing, but nobody passed 30. Bowling though wise, man, Arshdeep found his, oh, he found his niche today. Bowling for India, you had Arshdeep Singh with four wickets for nine runs and he had support from Hardik Pandey with two wickets as the Indians contained the USA batting, not letting anybody really score any real type of runs. Feeling wise, India were on top of it. Batting wise, I gotta say, it's the same wicket that has been given problems. So I understand the approach that USA had, but, but, I wish they had still stuck to their guns and played their game. However, however, different bowling, different unit. Yep, Pakistan was one part of it, but India is a whole different team and their bowlers, it's just a different game altogether. India, in their turn at the crease, took their time getting to the total. They ended up getting to 111 for three, leading the way for them. You had Shura, Shurya Kumar Yadav, who made 50, and he had support from Shivam Dubey with 31 as India won in 18.2 overs. Bowling for the US, you had Surab Netravalkar, who had two wickets for 18 runs from his four overs, leading the charge for the US. Now, Netravalkar actually, he, he got the big dogs at the top. He got Kohli and he got Rohit Sharma. But he just, one man could only do so much. And you need more than one bowler, man. You need more than one of your bowlers to step up and fire, which I think is what lacked for USA Today. India, on the other hand, they had uh, Shriya Kumar Yadav, who today was like, you know what, I'm going to find my form today and I'm going to turn on. And we all know when he turns on, when Sky turns on, Ain't no stopping that man. The, the array of shots he plays is enough <laughs> to make any bowler think, what do I bowl to this guy now? And what what will work? So can't can't really say that USA didn't try, but definitely bowling wise wasn't the best today. Whereas for India, when their players are in form, there's no stopping them, man. And India reminded the US, hey. We're the top dogs, okay? You just remember that. We know you, you beat the, you beat Pakistan and you, you beat Canada, but you know, we're, we're a different set of people here, man. We play our cricket differently. Different opponents here. The boys in blue. Mm, that's right. Just a good reminder for the USA that you know, the oppositions, they're tough. There's there's tougher oppositions. Pakistan might have had an off day and you would have might have capitalized on that, but hey. Every team is different and they bring their own set of assets to the game. And today, that was Arshdeep for India and he delivered, man. He delivered when he needed to deliver. Fired up the bowlers and that is exactly what the Indian team needed. So hats off to you, India, on winning this match. Reminding the U.S., hey, the top dogs are still in this tournament. But the U.S., to your credit, I will say to your credit, you still took them to almost 20 overs. But hey, that's just the way I saw the game. This is this is this is the most intriguing World Cup I will say so far because it's been a while since a co-host and a host nation are have actually played this good of cricket leading up. And I gotta say, it's it's got me it's got me thinking that there's there's bigger things to come. But we'll see. US New York, the ground hasn't been, I don't like it, I don't like New York, like I said, I've said it before, dig up that wicket, get rid of it, burn it, rebuild that, but the cricket must go on and the World Cup must go on, India looking good, they're, they're, just, they're just looking really good as a team, and the USA, you still got one match to play, so you never know what's going to happen, but hey, thank you for joining us here on We Talk Cricket, we appreciate the support, we appreciate you coming back. Don't forget to check out our other videos, alright? Until next time, my peeps. Later.